my channel, Brandon Manny's channel. I appreciate you being here. Uh, welcome to the DVD Blu-ray collection of mine that I'm about to show you all, guys. Um, let's get into it. First, we have Ben Hur, uh, William, directed by William Wyler and direct, uh, starring Charleston Heston. Um, it's got four discs, as you can tell. Uh, actually, yeah, five. And then we have what is really cool about this is. Uh, a lot of uh, essays and pictures from the behind the scenes uh, you have in this collection as well. Um, a bunch of special features you have uh, as well as um, the 1925 silent black and white version which is very impressive so Ben-Hur. Then we have the Godfather trilogy all three along with some special features. And then we have Troy, uh, the director's cut, starring Brad Pitt, Orlando Bloom, and directed by Ridley Scott. We got uh, some goodies in here. We got the disc for the special features in the movie. We got some pictures. And then we have a little booklet here uh, talking about the behind the scenes and doing some essays and all that. And then we have what is uh, really cool, the 70th anniversary of The Wizard of Oz with Judy Garland and uh, directed by um, Victor Fleming, who also directed the next movie in my collection, Gone with the Wind, with a bunch of special, different special features. We've got four, uh, four discs full of goodies. And uh, what's really, really cool about this is you have a little booklet as well as the rest of uh, the discs to give you uh, plenty of material to watch. And then we have Cecil B. DeMille's The Ten Commandments, the uh, Charleston Heston version, uh, which this one is the 50th anniversary edition, which includes the original 1923 silent film. And then we have Steven Spielberg's Close Encounters of the Third Kind. It's the 30th uh, anniversary edition. Uh, and then we have uh, West Side Story. It's, this one's really neat. Um, it won uh, Best Picture. Uh, it's a musical and uh, we got a little booklet. We have the DVDs for the special features and all that. And then we have the booklet for the script, which is actually really cool, if you can see. Um, it's very, very neat. I'm an avid collector of uh, all this uh, kind of stuff. I love the special features. I love the little goodies that come in with all these. And then we have the 70th anniversary of Citizen Kane. Orson Welles directed and starred in this one of my favorite directors as well as one of my favorite actors. Um, you have a little booklet called, with a bunch of photos and all that kind of stuff behind the scenes. You have uh, this little booklet with a bunch of like little posters. As you can see, it's really, really, really cool. And then we have James Cameron's Avatar. You got got uh, three discs with a bunch of special features. You got the original theatrical, you got uh, the extended, and then the re-release, recut version. Uh, as you can tell, that's a little odd with these other ones that I was talking about, but the reason for that is because I'm going through this, my special collector's um, edition, boxed edition, so. And then uh, we have Rambo, all uh, four of them. I do not own the fifth one. I, do, I have not even seen that one yet. So we got a bunch of special features as well as this huge box with uh, so much uh, cool stuff as well. A little booklet talking about the special features. And then we have Sin City, directed by Robert Rodriguez. Uh, the recut extended unrated edition. And then we got Pearl Harbor, the director's cut. 
Uh, why do I own this? Well, it just looks cool and, you know, it's a collector's edition. It's got four discs, a bunch of special features. I'm a sucker for those, so... Not that the movie's good, but we all know. <laughs> um, then we have the Great Lawrence of Arabia. It's a really neat, special, rare, limited edition with a little pamphlet and a booklet with lots of uh, essays and stuff and special features, so yeah. And then we have Titanic, James Cameron's Titanic. Leonardo DiCaprio, the Special Collector's 3-Disc Edition. And then we have uh, Sea Biscuit. Um, what is most impressive? Then we have Sea Biscuit, uh, 2-Disc Rare Edition, uh, Limited Edition. It's really, really neat with a bunch of uh, behind the scenes and all that kind of stuff. We have, then we have Gladiator, directed by Ridley Scott and uh, starring Russell Crowe. The extended edition, three discs, all special features. And then we have the Ridley Scott Kingdom of Heaven, four disc director's cut. It's uh, really, really good. It's uh, I would I highly recommend the director's cut um, instead of the theatrical because they cut so much out of the theatrical cut that it doesn't make any sense. So the four hour version is the best version to go. Up next we have all three theatrical editions of Lord of the Rings, Fellowship, Two Towers, and Return of the King. All of them. And then what we have next is the Hobbit prequel trilogy. The uh, two discs, Hobbit, Desolation of Smog, Battle of Five Armies, and The Unexpected Journey. And up next we have is Blade Runner, the original four disc collector's edition, which is the final cut uh, and has uh, so many great special features. And then we also have the sequel Blade Runner 2049. Up next we have the Alien Quadrilogy, uh, which is nine discs all in one package. You got a bunch of special features and all that. Very neat. With uh, these are also the director's cuts. Um, then we have the original King Kong, two disc special edition. Uh, we have the newer version, 2005 King Kong, uh, two disc special edition theatrical version. And then we have the King Kong uh, extended uh, director's cut, three disc edition with a bunch of more special features. So. Then continuing on, we have the uh, Hobbit Extended Edition, the first one, the second one, as well as the third one. And then as well as we have the Extended Editions of the Lord of the Rings, Fellowship of the Ring, Two Towers, and Return of the King. We have the Indiana Jones original trilogy with the bonus material and then we have the two disc special edition of Indiana Jones the King of the Crystal Skull. Up next we have my Star Wars collection the limited edition A New Hope. We have the uh, Return of the Jedi and Empire Strikes Back. Empire Strikes Back was so good. And then we have Trilogy uh, prequel, The Revenge of the Sith, Attack of the Clones, and Ben Menace. And then we have uh, the one of Rogue One, the newest Star Wars Force Awakens uh, trilogy for The Last Jedi. And I do not own The Rise of Skywalker. I mean, what can be said about that movie that's not been said already? So, And then we have the starting Marvel collection, Hellboy, the original, with uh, the director's cut, uh, three disc edition, all the special nifty special uh, features. We got uh, the three disc special edition of Hellboy 2. And then we have 
the director's cut of Electra, the director's cut of Daredevil, the theatrical two disc edition of Daredevil, we got Ghost Rider, we have the uh, original Blade Runner trilogy, Blade Runner Blade trilogy, we got the first Blade, second Blade, as well as something we don't want ever want to talk about, Blade Trilogy. <laughs> and then we have the Fantastic Four and Fantastic Four 2 Silver Surfer. And then we have Hulk. Uh, this is the two-disc edition. This is the, not the Marvel Hulk. This is the uh, Eric Bana Hulk. If you guys haven't seen it, it's, it's a bit strange, but hey. Up next we have the X-Men Collection 1 and 2. We got X-Men 3 The Last Stand. We got the 2-disc version, 3-disc, or no, 2-disc version of X-Men Wolverine. We got X-Men First Class and the Rogue Cut of X-Men Days of Future Past, my favorite uh, X-Men out of them all. And then we have the Wolverine. Got X-Men Apocalypse. And then we have Deadpool, Logan, and Deadpool 2. Going back to Logan, my second favorite of uh, all the X-Men movies. And then we have Spider-Man. We have Spider-Man 2. Spider-Man 2.1, the extended edition. And then in Spider-Man 3. Up next we have The Amazing Spider-Man and The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Uh, I like this one, but the second one, I'm not really a big fan of. But got a, your uh, DVD collector, or uh, Blu-ray collector, what kind of ever movie collector you are. I uh, just collect them. And uh, up next we have... 23 movie collection cinematic universe of Marvel Studios as you can see you got uh, all the f all films 12 discs from Iron Man to the latest Spider-Man film so it's uh, pretty nice it is really nice and first up we have Superman the movie we got uh, four discs here of a uh, bunch of great stuff theatrical expanded and a bunch of special features. We got Superman 2. Uh, we have Superman Returns. We got the original Batman Foursome, Batman. Batman Returns. Batman Forever and Batman and Robin. And then we have the Dark Knight Trilogy. We got Batman Begins, The Dark Knight, and The Dark Knight Rises, all of them two discs special editions. And then we have the two disc director's cut of Watchmen. We have the widescreen edition of Catwoman. Don't ask me why I own that. <laughs> we got the two disc version of Speed for Vendetta. We have Green Lantern, Man of Steel, Batman vs. Superman. And then we have Suicide Squad, Wonder Woman, Justice League, and Aquaman. And I just bought this as you can tell, so it hasn't been open yet. And then we have the Raid Redemption and the Raid 2. Uh, these films are probably the greatest action films of all time. So good. They're uh, actually made from Indonesia, so check them out sometime. Then we have the Expendables, Expendables 2, and then we have 300, we have 300 Rise of an Empire, we have the two Sherlock Holmes movies, Game of Shadows, and then we have Olympus Has Fallen and Ain London Has Fallen. I do not have Angel Has Fallen. And then we have the 
John Wick chapters 1, 2, and 3, all in one package. This one's new, obviously, as you can tell, because uh, I just got it the other day, too. You got Atomic Blonde, Cloverfield, 10 Cloverfield Lane, Kingsman the Secret Service. Then we have the sequel to Kingsman. We have the Mask of Zorro. We have the Legend of Zorro. And then we have Gettysburg and Gods and Generals. And then we have Transformers and Transformers Redock of the Moon. Um, I only own these two because this one is actually not too bad, and then this one's just kind of a guilty pleasure. And then we have Bad Boys and Bad Boys 2. I do not own the latest one yet, but that one's a good one as well. Uh, we got 21 and 22 Jump Street. We got Scooby-Doo 1 and 2. We have as well as Stuart Little 1 and 2. We got the uh, Men in Black Trilogy. We got Men in Black, Men in Black 2, and Men in Black 3. Uh, we also have the Mummy Trilogy uh, with Brendan Fraser, the first one, second one, and third one. We got uh, next up is the Terminator, Terminator 2, and Terminator 3. And then we have the Matrixes, type of Matrixes. We got the Matrix, Matrix Reloaded, as well as Matrix Revolutions. And then we have up next Dr. No, The Rural from Russia with Love, and Thunderball. We have Living Daylights, Die Another Day. We have Casino Royale, we have Quantum of Solace, we have Skyfall, my favorite of all of them. We have Planet of the Apes, the original. We have Planet of the Apes Collection. We also have uh, Planet of the Apes, Mark Wahlberg. We also have Rise, the prequel. We have Dawn, as well as War for the Planet of the Apes. And then we have all six Resident Evil movies. And then we have the Toho Godzilla collection. The Toho Godzilla volumes one and two. And then we have Godzilla, the 2014 version with Brian Cranston. We got the Fast and Furious, we got 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. Um, don't own the first three because eh, they're fine, but I don't think they're worth having in the collection. Um, and then we have the full Harry Potter collection. We got all two disc versions. We got Sorcerer's Stone. We got all these in the collection. So. Fantastic collection. And then we have the uh, Twilight Sega, all uh, five. And then we have the Hunger Games Collection 4 film. And then we have the Final Destination, all five. Can't wait till the sixth one comes out. It's going to be really cool. Uh, the seven movie collection of Saw, the Kill Bill Volume 1 and 2. We have all Dirty Harry collection. We have uh, Beverly Hills Cop and Back to the Future. All three of them. Then we have the Born Legacy Classified Collection. Um, then we have Lethal Weapon 1 through 4. We have all of the six movie collection Mission Impossibles. Then we have all four diehards, not the last one because that one does not exist. Then we have the two disc version of Star Trek. And then we have the Underworld uh, 
first one, the first Underworld. I do not own the other ones. And then we have Mad Max Fury Road. We have Pacific Rim. We have King Kong Skull Island. We have Kick-Ass. We have Predator with Arnold Schwarzenegger. We have Aragon, the two-disc special edition. We have Abraham Lincoln Vampire Hunter, one of my favorite guilty pleasures. Um, we have Leonardo DiCaprio's Shutter Island. We have The Guest. We have Hot Fuzz. We have The First Taken. We have The Towering Inferno. We have The Poseidon Adventure, the original. Then we have remake Poseidon and then we have Stephen King's The Mist which is excellent here it is excellent one of the best endings of all time and then we have Stargate starring Kurt Russell as well as James Spader and then we have uh, Independence Day we have the 1999 version of Godzilla we have The Patriot The Day After Tomorrow 2012, White House Down, which is the PG-13 version of Olympus Has Fallen, and both of these are good, but Olympus Has Fallen is better. Then we have G.I. Joe, The Rise of Cobra. We have The First Pirates, Second Pirates, Third, Fourth, and then we have National Treasure, National Treasure 2, and then we have Narnia, Narnia 2, we got Prince of Persia, and then we have The Lone Ranger. And then we have Pollyanna, we have Old Yeller, we have Swiss Family Robinson, one of my personal favorite uh, Disney movies, classics. Uh, we have The Miracle Worker, we have Tom and Huck, another personal favorite of mine from the 90s. We got The Prince's Diaries, the two disc special edition, and the widescreen Prince's Diaries 2. We have High School Musical. We have Saving Mr. Banks. And we have Christopher Robin. And then my Pixar collection, Toy Story 1, 2, 3, and 4. Then we have A Bug's Life, Monsters, Inc., The Incredibles, which this one is uh, my very first DVD uh, in the collection. I This is actually the oldest one in the collection. It's, uh, it came out in 2005 when it came out on DVD, um, and I've had this ever since my very first DVD. It's the original one, so the OG right here, guys, the OG. Then we have Cars, Wally, -E, Up, Ratatouille, Inside Out, Coco, Incredibles 2. And then for my original Disney animation classics, uh, Snow White, Pinocchio, Bambi, Dumbo, Cinderella, Peter Pan, Alice in Wonderland, we got Song of the South, we got Lady and the Tramp, we got uh, Sleeping Beauty, we have the Aristocats, we have 101 Dalmatians, we got Fun and Fancy Free, we have The Jungle Book, we have Robin Hood, one of my personal favorites. We got Fox and the Hound, another one personal favorite of mine. Uh, we have Pete's Dragon. We have The Rescuers. We got Many Adventures of Winnie the Pooh. We have The Sword in the Snow and Oliver and Company. Uh, we have The Little Mermaid. The Great Mouse Detective, another personal favorite of mine. We got Beauty and the Beast and Aladdin. And then we have Mulan, 
Pocahontas, The Lion King, Hercules. We have The Hunchered, Hunchback of Notre Dame, which is a personal favorite of mine. We got a uh, new groove. We got Tarzan, another favorite of mine. We have Dinosaur. We have The Rescuers Down Under, one of my favorites as well, Lilo and Stitch. We have Brother Bear. We have Atlantis, The Lost Empire. We have Treasure Planet, Chicken Little. And then we have Return to Another Neverland. We have a Tigger movie. And then we have Homeward Bound. We have DuckTales. We have The Three Musketeers. And then we have The Lion King One and a Half. We have Buzz Lightyear of Star Command, a childhood favorite of mine. And then we have The Princess and the Frog. And then we have Bolt. And then Big Hero 6, Wreck-It Ralph. We have Frozen. We have Zootopia, Moana, Winnie the Pooh, Air Bud, Flubber, Mighty Joe Young, The Jungle Book, my personal favorite of all the Jungle Books, uh, Ants, The Prince of Egypt, The Road to El Dorado, and then we have Spirit of Stallion on the Cimarron. The last three I just showed you, so good. They're all three of my are so good. Uh, we got Chicken Little, <laughs> Chicken Run, we got Sinbad, Flushed Away, B-Movie, Over the Hedge, we have Shark Tale, we have Megamind, we have Rise of the Guardians, we have all of the Shrek films in one package, uh, we have all three Madagascars in one package, we have all three Kung Fu Pandas in one package, and all three uh, How to Train Your Dragons in one package. And then we have Scooby-Doo and the Cyber Chase, Scooby-Doo Zombie Island, Scooby-Doo Brian the Ruck Reluctant Werewolf, Scooby-Doo Meets Batman, can you tell them about Scooby-Doo? <laughs> uh, the Iron Giant, the Lego Movie, the Lego Batman Movie, sadly I haven't opened this sadly yet. Um, Legend of the Guardians, Anastasia, Thumbelina, Happy Feet, A Troll in Central Park, one of uh, my family's sister, my sisters, and my my personal favorites. Uh, we used to borrow this from our Nana and Papa all the time, so yeah. We got American uh, Tale and American Tale Fuel Goes West. Uh, Fuel Goes West stars is, uh, I believe, James Stewart's last uh, film role ever before he passed, so gotta own that. Because um, I'm a huge fan of James Stewart. Uh, we're back at Dinosaur Story. We got all three Despicable Me movies. And then we got the Ice Age movies 1, 2, and 3. And Ice Age Don Dinosaurs is my personal favorite. And then we have Robots and Fantastic Mr. Fox. We have Hotel Transylvania. We have Cloudy with a Chains of Meatballs. We got Planet 51. We have Open Season. We have The Swan Princess. Personal favorite of mine. <laughs> um, we have G.I. Joe Bella vs. Venom. Uh, the Incredibles was the first one I ever owned. This is the first one I ever got as a gift. I will never forget that um, from my grandmother. Uh, and, like, holy cow, like, I remember when I first saw this, I'm like, what is this, a computer game, or what? This is, like, the first time I ever saw a DVD, so, it's really cool. Um, we have Nine, we have Charlotte's Web, we have The Adventures of Tintin, we have The Pebble and the Penguin, which is another favorite of mine, we have Who Framed Roger Rabbit, we have Space Jam, we have Looney Tunes Back in Action. We have the Naked Gun Trilogy. We have Hot Shots 1 and 2. We have the Rush Hour Trilogy. We have the Austin Powers Trilogy.
we have the Shanghai Nights and Shanghai Noon. We have the Night at the Museum trilogy. We have the Pitch Perfect trilogy. We have the Indian in the Cupboard uh, movie. We have the Page Master. We have Alvin and the Chipmunks. We have Anchorman and Anchorman 2. We have Wedding Crashers. We have She's the Man. We have Monty Python and the Holy Grail. And the original Jumanji. We have the newest Jumanji. Uh, we have The Mask. We have Father of the Bride 1 and 2. We have Free Willy. The Water Horse. Patch Adams. E.T. Peter Pan. 2003 version. The Sister Act 1 and 2. Both uh, cheaper by the dozens. We have Spy Kids 1, 2, and 3. We have The Truman Show, excellent film. Mr. Deeds. We have Clue the Movie. Spaceballs, absolutely hilarious. Uh, the Goonies. Zoolander, one of my favorite comedies. Robin Hood Men of Tights, another favorite comedy. It's hilarious. And then we have uh, Vote for Pedro. Nope, <laughs> just kidding. Napoleon Dynamite. We have Johnny English. We have Happy Gilmore. We have Billy Madison. We have Dumb and Dumber. We have Dr. Doolittle. We have Fat Albert. We have Paul Blart, There's Something About Mary, Airplane, Dodgeball, Grown Ups, The Pacifier, The Muppets, we have Honey I Shrunk the Kids, we have Big, we have Dave, we have Hook, we have Bring It On, we have School of Rock, a personal favorite of mine. Meet the Parents, another personal favorite comedy of mine. Big Fat Greek Wedding. We have Click. Mrs. Doubtfire, absolute classic. We have Game Night. We have Lassie. We have Coming to America. And we have Blazing Saddles. We have Office Space. We have Liar to Liar. We have The Hangover. We have Casper, a favorite of mine from the 90s. By Centennial Man, one of my favorite Robin Williams films. Small Soldiers, another childhood favorite of mine. We got Beetlejuice. Better not say that two more, two more times. <laughs> uh, Bruce Almighty. We got 50 First Dates. We got Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. We got Cats and Dogs. We got Bewitched. We got the Ace Ventura films. We got Nacho Libre. We have Andre. We have The Prince's Diaries. We have Thomas and the Magic Railroad. We have Big Mama's House. We have Get Smart, we have Babe, we have Baby's Day Out, which is a personal favorite of mine and my sister's, we have The Nutty Professor, we have Three Amigos, we have What Women Want, we have Edward Scissorhands, we have Seventeen Again, we have Ferris Bueller's Day Off, we have Sky High, we have Groundhog Day, Freaky Friday, Ghostbusters, War Games, a personal favorite of mine, Richie Rich, classic 90s, Racing Stripes, Mouse Hunt, 
Bridesmaids. And then a personal favorite of mine, Mean Girls. And then we have White Christmas. We have Holiday Inn. It's a Wonderful Life. Miracle on 34th Street. Home Alone 1, 2, and 3. The Santa Claus. Elf. The Grinch Who Stole Christmas. The Polar Express. Christmas with the Cranks. The Nutcracker. Christmas Vacation. Mickey's Christmas Carol. Veggie Tales. Uh, double feature The Toy Who Saved Christmas and The Star of Christmas. Beauty and the Beast. The Enchanted Christmas. We have Jack Frost. Christmas Story. Gremlins. The Santa Claus 2. Scrooged. Jingle All the Way. The Nativity Story. The Nightmare Before Christmas. And, the, and Planes, Trains, and Autumn. The Sound of Music, The King and I, Oklahoma, Singing in the Rain, Meet Me in St. Louis, My Fair Lady, Yankee Doodle Dandy, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, Moulin Rouge, Guys and Dolls, Fiddler on the Roof, we got Anything Goes, Mary Poppins, La La Land, Into the Woods, Pirates of Penzance, Summer Stock, Hairspray, Shrek the Musical, 1776, a personal favorite musical of mine. Phantom of the Opera, Newsies, Sweeney Todd, Les Miserables, Rent, Bye Bye Birdie, Seven Brides for Seven Brothers, Annie, Sing Street, Got the Producers, Hello Dolly, An American in Paris, The Court Gesture, a personal favorite of mine, Easter Parade, and Mamma Mia, the first one, Chicago, Dream Girls, Grease, Oliver, The Greatest Showman, Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat, the Good, the Bad, and the Ugly, A Few Dollars More, A Fistful of Dollars, Django Unchained, A Hateful Eight, The Unforgiven, you have Bonnie and Clyde, you have The Country of Old Men, 310 to Yuma, Dances with Wolves, so good. Magnificent Seven, the original. Treasure of Sierra Madre. Butch Cassidy and the Suncans Kid. Tombstone. Once Upon a Time in the West. And How the West Was Won. The Wild Bunch. High Noon. The Searchers. Open Range. The Magnificent Seven, the remake, which is actually really good, surprisingly. You got True Grit, 1917, The Longest Day, A Bridge Too Far. You have Apocalypse Now, Black Hawk Down, three disc deluxe edition. You got Flags of Our Fathers, Letters from Iwo Jima, Saving Private Ryan, uh, you have American Sniper, We Were Soldiers, Tears of the Sun, The Hurt Locker, Glory, 
Valkyrie, the Glorious Bastards, and Red Dawn. You have Fury, Hacksaw Ridge, Full Metal Jacket, Patton, Platoon, Jaws, Halloween, The Exorcist, The Shining, The Sleepy Hollow, It Chapter One, Crawl, An American Werewolf in London, Scream, Get Out, The Village, you have The Sixth Sense, Tremors, 1408, Dusk Till Dawn, Plant Tear, The Happening, Bram Stoker's Dracula, Halloween, Dawn of the Dead, Zombieland, Silence of the Lambs, Poltergeist, Van Helsing, Annihilation, Mother, Quarantine, <laughs> Hangman's Curse, The Abyss, A Quiet Place, Ex Machina, Signs, The Fountain, Unbreakable, The Shape of Water, What Dreams May Come, a personal Robert Williams favorite of mine, and the rival. AI Artificial Intelligence, Passengers, District 9, Robocop, Super Troopers, Ready Player One, Total Recall, War of the Worlds, iRobot, I Am Legend, Edge of Tomorrow, Armageddon, Deep Impact, Premonition, Interstellar, Gravity, the Butterfly Effect, In Time, The Road, Book of Eli, and Prisoners. Prisoners, so good. Don't Breathe, The Invisible Man, Collateral, The Martian, Flight Plan, Phone Booth, Firewall, Nightcrawler, Now You See Me, Buried, Reservoir Dogs, Crimson Tide, The Hunt for Red October, K-19, The Widowmaker, American Psycho, Heat, The Town, Edge of Darkness, The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo, Hannah, A History of Violence, Panic Room, Fatal Attraction, The Fugitive, Apollo 13, The Untouchables, Public Enemies, Executive Decision, The Negotiator, Inception, Vantage Point, The Grey, Snowpiercer, Death Proof, Baby Driver, Knives Out, Nonstop, Source Code, Free Fire, Knight's Tale, Couching Tiger Hidden Dragon, The Last of the Mohicans, Braveheart, and The Last Samurai. Master and Commander, Hidalgo, Top Gun, Alexander the Director's Cut, Alexander's The Final Cut, Defiance, Mr. Smith and Mr. and Mrs. Smith, Dread, Minority Report, Equilibrium, 
Wanted, Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves, Robin Hood, the R Russell Crowe version, Tropic Thunder, Real Steel, San Andreas, Twister, Volcano, Hostage, Apocalypto, and then we have True Lies, The Rock, Con Air, Demolition Man, Eraser, Breakdown, Air Force One, Cliffhanger, Duel, Speed, Last Action Hero, Split, Zodiac, Black Swan, Empire of the Sun, Castaway, Catch Me If You Can, One Hour Photo, the Leon the Professional, and Blood Diamond, Children of Men, The Musketeers, the Three, Radio, Roadhouse, Pulp Fiction, Memento, Seven, The Shawshank Redemption, The Green Mile, The Departed, Goodfellas, Casino, Gangs of New York, Ocean's Eleven, The Prestige, the Illusionist, Natural Born Killers, United 93, World Trade Center, Sicario, Misery, Changeling, Red Sparrow, Fight Club, There Will Be Blood, Schindler's List, Her, Room, Cape Fear, The Revenant, Life of Pi, Gone Girl, The Jackal, Drive, Passion of the Christ, 127 Hours, Searching, The Intern, A Series of Unfortunate Events, When Harry Met Sally, Eighth Grade, The Big Sick, The Edge Seventeen, Hail Caesar, The Lady Killers, Lost in Translation, The Terminal, Forrest Gump, A Star is Born, Twelve Years a Slave, The Artist, Joy, Something's Gotta Give, Creed, Chaplin, Lincoln, Capote, JFK, The Secret Life of Walter Mitty, 42, Lady Bird, Little Women, the newest, Little Women, the 1990s, Little Women, the 1933 version, The Disaster Artist, and Mystic River. Got Magnolia, The King's Speech, Scent of a Woman, Ed Wood, Captain Phillips, Heaven is for Real, First Man, Whiplash, Million Dollar Baby, Ray, Walk the Line, the Extended Edition, Walk the Line, Theatrical Cut, Crash, Glen Gary, Glen Ross, Slumdog Millionaire, Black Beauty, Spotlight, Brothers, Grand Torino, Goodwill Hunting, The Breakfast Club, Birdman, Shakespeare in Love, 
Good morning, Vietnam. Munich. Romeo and Juliet. The Aviator. Wolf of Wall Street. Pretty Woman. Philadelphia. A Beautiful Mind. American Beauty. Argo. Carlitos Way. Social Network. American Hustle. The Three Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri. Silence. The Great Gatsby. A Few Good Men. Rain Man. Field of Dreams. Atonement. Meet Joe Black. Footloose. Hugo. The Pursuit of Happiness. Journey to the Center of the Earth, the original. The Blue Lagoon. Annie Hall. In the Heat of the Night. MASH. You got Deliverance. Dog Day Afternoon. Bullet, Chariots of Fire, Guess Who's Coming to Dinner, The French Connection, Gandhi, Once Upon a Time in America, The Usual Suspects, The Big Lebowski, Dead Poet Society, The Original Footloose, Talented Mr. Ripley, Amistad, Road to Perdition, Pride and Prejudice, Brooklyn, LA Confidential, Midnight in Paris, Roadback Mountain, Pleasantville, and Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind, Paris When It Sizzles, Taxi Driver, Amadeus, Dr. Strangelove, Rocky, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, Scarface, Arsenic and Old Lace, Harvey, Captain Blood, The Seahawk, The Mark of Zorro, Judgment in Nuremberg, Inherit the Wind, Witness for the Prosecution, Some Like It Hot, Cleopatra, The Apartment, The Original Tarzan Collection, The Long Long Trailer, 500 Days of Summer, Ghost, Dirty Dancing, Silver Linings Playbook, Hoosiers, Jerry Maguire, and Saturday Night Fever. Raging Bull, To Kill a Mockingbird, The Day the Earth Stood Still, The Marx Brothers Collection, The Robe, The Philadelphia Story, A Streetcar Named Desire, Maltese Falcon, Casablanca, Dr. Shivago, The Hustler, The Great Escape, 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea, Forbidden Planet, Around the World in 80 Days, Eyes Wide Shut, The Adventures of Robin Hood, Gone with the Wings 70th Anniversary Edition, Five disc version. East of Eden. Giant. Rebel Without a Cause. Sunset Boulevard. Roman Holiday. Sabrina. Funny Face. Breakfast at Tiffany's. The Odd Couple. Chinatown. Bridge on the River Kauai, The Sting, 
Double Indemnity, Deer Hunter, The Imitation of Life, both versions, Mr. Smith Goes to Washington, Murder on the Orient Express, Touch of Evil 50th Anniversary Edition, Creature from the Black Ragoon, all the movies, uh, The Invisible Man, the originals, all the original movies, The Mummy, Frankenstein, Dracula, Alfred Hitchcock's Legacy of Suspense, and The Wolfman. Rear Window, my absolutely favorite film of all time, Vertigo, Psycho, Dial On for Murder, North by Northwest, Rope, Strangers on a Train, The Man Who Knew Too Much. Can you tell I'm a Halford Hitchcock fan? All Quiet on the Western Front, The Big Parade, Metropolis, Buster Keaton's The General, Birth of a Nation, Buster Keaton Shorts, Edison Shorts, you got The Seventh Seal, Some Like It Hot Criterion, The Stagecoach, Twelve Angry Men, M by Fritz Lang, The Curious Case of Benjamin Button, The Princess Bride, Monsieur Vidou, The Red Shoes, It Happened One Night, A Night to Remember, Then Pyrie, Seven Samurai, Bicycle Thieves, The Before Trilogy, Marriage Story, Spartacus, On the Waterfront, Young Mr. Lincoln, Gojira, the original Godzilla, The Freshman, The Passion of Joan of Arc, Diabolique, Anatomy of a Murder, Safety Last, City Lights, The Gold Rush, The Great Dictator, The Kid, Modern Times, Al Jolson's The Jazz Singer, the very first sound film, Nosferatu, Battleship Potemkin, Wings, The Charlie Chaplin Collection, you got City Lights, The Circus, The Kid, A Woman of Paris, King of New York, The Chaplin Review, Messier Boudou, the other ones that you saw uh, earlier were uh, the um, Criterion Collection, this is the Chaplin Collection, can you tell I'm a Charlie Chaplin fan? <laughs> um, Chaplin, his shorts. Charlie Chaplin Collection, The Modern Times, The Great Dictator, The Gold Rush, and Limelight. And that was my DVD collection. I want to thank you for being here. It is much appreciated that you were here. I hope you stayed for the whole thing. I don't know if you skipped around. That's fine. It was a long video. Uh, or if you came for the uh, multiple parts to make it shorter, I appreciate that as well. Uh, I would uh, appreciate it if you click the subscribe button, click the bell, as well as commenting down below what you loved, what you didn't love, you know, any critiques, anything. It would be so much appreciated. I uh, also ask that you uh, share this video. I also ask that you uh, go check out all the other content on the channel. There's top tens, vlogs, as well as a future podcast that I hopefully have coming as well as so much other content uh, for you to check out. So I appreciate you being here again. Stay random.